everyone welcome to 7f5r live on instagram this is the 40th episode of this series it is currently the 29th of june 2022 2 45 p.m on a sunny wednesday afternoon here in singapore thank you so much for joining us whether you're watching this live or as a recording my name is stephanie jennifer i am a czt21 and i'll be your host for this session in just a bit, I'll be joined by my co-hosts Debbie Niu, CZT18, and Susan Yeo, CZT Asia 2. We're so happy to have you here. So like we normally do, we'll be tangling for the next hour, hour and a half. You can take out some materials if you like to draw along with us. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Susan. Hi. Hi. Susan mentioned that um, her son is not sleeping. <laughs> oh, why you shame Isaac? So bad. So, so she might not. I'm yeah. explaining. So she might have to mute herself. Don't shame him. Next no, time no shame. Watch, Maybe you heard, no shame. The, heard the, the boy playing mm. some blocks. Next time when he goes up, then you watch our show, then you shame him so bad. It's not shame, what? It's just not sleep. Not tired, like what? Shame him. Yeah, not tired. Energy. <laughs> Next time so. he, don't, he don't like us, really. Because he talk about Hi-o. him. Hi, so all of our live sessions are recorded um, and made available on our Instagram page at 7 First 5 Rivers and also on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash C slash 7 at 5 R Studio. You can also follow each of us on Instagram. Debbie can be found at tangled.pursuits. Susan is at susanyo.czt and I am at halfpen underscore will draw. For our Wednesday live sessions, we feature the uh, weekly tea and tangle, uh, featured tangle in the 7F5 Challenge group on Facebook. You can join the group, it's free. You just have to answer some uh, questions to make sh- for us to make sure that you're not a bot. Uh, you can search I guess security questions. Yeah, you can search mm. 7F5 Challenge directly in Facebook's search bar, or you can also go to bit.ly slash fb. Seven and five bar. Yeah, today's featured tangle is Swing Leaf by Sunalisha. I believe Susan has a string for us. Oh yeah, we have to go through our materials first. Pardon me. What are you guys using today? Hey, uh, I prepared a zandala. I think mm-hmm. this one is a is a gray color. Then I previously I think I used a magical. To, to tinted it for quite a long time, but I haven't used it. <laughs> then I also stand by another card that I tinted yesterday using uh, what? The color P. I can't remember. That one is the color that can tint it on top, uh, paper and also fabric. So I stand by these two. Then with my uh, Jerry Roll White and my Apprentice Pen 05, then two Luxury Pen. Yeah, this is the one that we got it from the CZTAE. I can't remember which one. 2020? <laughs> Color P. Yeah. So cute. It's, it's like water yeah. marbling, is it? Oh, yes, yes. Mm, okay, okay. Mm, so very funny. Debbie, you le? What tar are you using, Steph? Yo, what's that for me? <laughs> no, because I, I <laughs> always... an apprentice uh, size tar. Well, I mean, uh, I always see what I always see what you guys are doing before I do. So, let's skip over first, then do something different. No lah, yeah. because I rather so, have three different ones, kind of right? Watery. Maybe you can do same same. <laughs> no lah, it's better than three yeah, so different. So swimming is kind of like a. Mm. So swimming is kind of like a water tangle. So I thought like, oh, this tinted tile would be nice. Yeah. So that's that's one of things. Lindy's gang magicals. I have no idea what color it is though. What about you, Debbie? Mm, actually, I have a black tile and a white tile. But I, I'm i trying to see what I have that could contrast with everyone nicely. Mm. 
ด้วยค่ะโอเค Susan do you like to share to this stream Okay so for today's stream is very simple it's a curvy line you can either diagonally have a curvy line in this way or maybe in the center just like a vertical line as long as it's in a curvy line so it will uh, match our tangle today Can be many curvy lines. Yes, if you want, you can. Then become a bottle, a ribbon. Hmm. About a river. Okay. Very simple. Ah, uh, string. Let me share to this tangle. To this tangle is. We'll be featuring a swing leaf by Sunali Shah. She's a CZT. Let me draw it along, you guys. Basically, you start off first with like a, a slightly curved line. So that will be the base shape of our swing leaf. It kind of resembles a lotus. So you, of course, have to add a stem. And then you join the two points of the initial first line that you drew, join it together, and then you create this top portion for it. So you get this sort of lotus leaf, lotus flower, not flower, lotus leaf shape. Okay, I actually went online to like search for like lotus specks. And then apparently the flowers, the lotus flowers actually opens in the morning and closes at night. So a lot of people consider the lotus as a symbol of like rebirth and creation. So that's that's quite interesting. Then from the, the uh, point in your little lotus, you're going to add the veins of the lotus leaf. So there's no real method to this. You're just drawing slightly jagged lines that connect to the edges. Of your lotus plant and of course they can connect to each other each of the segments and that is your swaying leaf i would also add shading to this because right now it looks kind of flat right so if you actually add shading over here uh, inside of the lotus leaf it will look more like it's sunken in so i think that that will make it interesting and fun so again today's string is a curvy line or multiple curvy lines if you prefer and then the featured tangle is swaying leaf by sunarisha hmm. susan today are you Hoping to follow the string, and will you ignore yes. the string? Yeah, I think I will keep the string. Okay, maybe you le? Will it be just like a general guideline for you? I think I will do a what seeds. Oh, okay. Or or a few, I don't know. And then the we'll what seeds will have the string, is it? Or the fascinator will have the string. I don't know how to explain to you. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So, how are the both of you today? Okay. We started working on the end of the year project that we have planned. So it was a little messy, but I'm pleased with progress so far. For me, it's a very messy morning also. <laughs> uh, uh, don't know. Just like, when you wake up, then a lot of things then, <laughs> a lot of ad hoc things. Uh. Oh. Mm. Then today also, not feeling so well, running nose. So, hmm. Oh. 
Yeah, very bad. I don't like running nose. It's very tiring. <laughs> Hope I can become better before tomorrow our mm. meeting. Hmm. Where do you catch it from? You will find the other day there. <laughs> the little one got fever a few days mm. ago. Yeah, maybe I think I, I do not have enough sleep. Then the immune system getting down, most likely. I don't know. Mm. But I, I, I believe that sometimes we need to have a little flu or little uh, running nose <laughs> to build our immune system. <laughs> No, no, this is the, the one thing that the uh, friends told me before. So, hmm. once in a while I had a little sick and it's still acceptable. It's kind of like updating your antibodies. <laughs> updating, yeah. <I'll, laughs> you know that? how the, they have uh, the antivirus? Updating the apps. You know the mm. antivirus, they have different patches, right? Mm. So yes. They patch the yeah. software. Mm. Human version. Yeah. Yeah. Instead of taking the updated uh, booster or whatever, I yeah, just have this kind of uh, self uh, booster. <laughs> How about you, Debbie? How's your mm. today? I think this week I'm not very great though. This week feels very weird. <laughs> Yeah, so I, I usually feel okay. And then, you know, you know, we all have the money cramps, right? So usually when it comes to like around that time of the month, right? Oh, I feel, I feel as though I run over by the truck. I feel so tired. <laughs> yeah. Then I feel like, I feel like, um, there's because there's a lot of things that we are involved in and there's a lot of work. So I I feel like I'm tired all the time. Mm. Yeah, but I don't know, maybe it's it's something that I haven't discovered that I'm lacking or something. Maybe I should take a certain I don't know. Maybe it's cute. a vitamin. Last time I used to take Sangobion. Boost my hemoglobin. Okay. Do you want to start on questions? Well, today we have five questions. Um, a couple of them are quite short, actually. Hmm. Should I pick the easiest one? Sure. Okay. What are the projects you are currently working on? Oh. A lot of secret, secret projects. Can tell people? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. I finished, I think I brought it today. I finished uh, an autumn class, a CZTAE 2021 autumn project. I worked over, I worked it over like a week or so. So this is a new sketchbook that each of us at uh, Team 7 and 5 are, except for Daniel. Daniel didn't get one. <laughs> But uh, Debbie, Susan, and I each got one. It's a you can have mine. Sketchbook. Yeah, yeah, can share. So I've been like uh, tinting pages with using like different materials, and then when I'm like.
photo of it after I, I can erase it and take a photo of it so that's the before picture I think I can finish so that's that's what I'm working on lately past few days how about you Susan Debbie oh Steph you are back huh I'm back just now we, we saw your your screen is frozen oh no yeah then now Debbie though. is uh gone Gone, yes. Oh, no. <laughs> so actually, we didn't hear you sharing about the 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 booklet. Oh, 